Electromyography is typically reserved to really expensive biomedical devices, but believe it or not, you can do it with an Arduino too, and this handy little breakout board from Advancer Technologies. And this is called the MyoWare, and you can see I've soldered a few header pins on here already for another project, but today we're gonna just test it out and look at what the analog voltages are coming out of here. And you can imagine if you can get an analog voltage from zero to five volts, you could map that to say a servo to turn from zero to 180 degrees and create your own robotic arm or really anything you want. Remember, Arduino is about gathering input data and then sending data out. And this is a great way of getting EMG or the electrical signal from your muscles from your body into the Arduino. Now I'll have to admit, I cheated a little bit. You should read the data sheet and really understand how this works because placement is absolutely critical. And what I like to do is I take the sensor and I put it on my arm and without kind of touching it, I test and run a few tests till I find the perfect spot. I happen to find that there's a muscle right here and the mid, the mid muscle sensor sits perfectly on my arm in this location. And the, the ground over here can sit right here on my arm and I've been getting really good results. I will warn you though, before you try something like this, think about electricity and how it flows. I'm gonna be trying this with my computer. Do I really want my laptop plugged in to mains power and have my arm connected electrically to the Arduino? Probably not a good idea. Certainly not for anything commercial or for anyone to try. For testing purposes, I don't see a huge problem from, for me to unplug my laptop. Now it's, wow, that was quite a crash. And once my laptop's unplugged, I feel a lot safer in using this for prototyping. Again, read the manufacturer's data sheets because you can also run this also off of a nine volt battery and wire it differently so that you are completely disconnected. For this video, I wanna show you the serial output. So I want it connected to my computer. Again, please read that safety instruction because this is really important. You know, you, you do not wanna get hurt. And certainly this is not how you would use it in a commercial application. So that being said, if you go to the MyAware website, you can download the code. I have some sample code that I've already downloaded. I'm gonna open it up. And Arduino's loading up. My Arduino's plugged in. So before we wire it up, I'm gonna unplug my Arduino. And look at the code here. It's communicating at 9600 baud and we're reading analog zero. It's really just an analog read. So what I'm going to do is connect this up. So I'm gonna use this brown wire for negative, red for positive, and signal orange. And now I'll go ahead and connect that up to my Arduino, and I will do red into five volts, brown into ground, and analog zero with the orange wire. Now, one other little bit of information. It is much easier if you connect these electrodes to this first and then place it on your skin. But because I'm shooting a video, I decided to do it this way. The problem with it this way is I gotta push pretty hard to get these to snap on. It's not fun. But after a little bit of pushing and prodding, you'll get it connected. And then I also have this third lead that I'm connecting up here on my arm. Now, again, laptop's not plugged in. I'll plug this in. Make sure my board and port are red. There we go. And I'll upload it. Done uploading, and I'm gonna open up the serial monitor. And you can see I'm reading basically zero volts. And what's interesting with this is as I flex, I can increase that voltage quite a bit. I'm getting up to about one I'll tell you, I would probably tweak this a little more to get a little bit of a better voltage out of here. I'm getting about one. Probably need to move this. I actually think I can move it a little bit. Right here, and we're starting to see more voltage as I flex my arm. And there we go. We're getting a good four, three, four volts out of that sensor. And that's basically how you would read the electrical energy that's in your muscles, creating your own EMG with Arduino. But again, remember safety first, especially when you're connecting yourself. 
to your Arduino.